we're going to look at reading a preference table in our next problem. Three candidates, A, B, and C, are running for mayor of a small town. The results of the election are shown in the following preference table. And we notice that we have the number of votes across the top row. We have our first choice, second choice, and third choice given in the columns. The question is, how many people voted in the election? The number of votes running across the top row is what we're interested in. We're going to take the sum of those. So we'll take 1,200, add to it 900, plus another 900 from the next column, plus 600 from our last column. Adding together, we see we have 1,200, plus, I'm going to go ahead and combine these to give 1,800, plus 600. The first two combine together to give us 3,000 plus 600 to give us our total of 3,600 votes. 